Unbelievable. What our coach just said after the first game of the season is making all Oregon fans very concerned about what is happening. In the last few hours, this has been the main topic among Oregon fans, because what he said is worrying. And what should we do for the rest of the season after this happened? I confess to you that I am now worried and I want to update you on this shocking news that is leaving all fans speechless, because it is something that worries us and you need to know everything that happened. But first, I want to make a special request to you, Oregon fan. Are you just arriving on our channel and not yet subscribed? Then subscribe right now, like and show your support for the channel. Now without further ado, let's get to the news. In the last few hours this shocking news was confirmed. Get ready, Ducks fan. This Saturday, Autzen Stadium will be buzzing as our Oregon Ducks take on the Boise State Broncos. With last week's win behind them, there's plenty of room for improvement, and head coach Dan Lanning is making sure the Ducks are ready to dominate. From the struggles on the offensive line to the challenge of facing a top-tier running back, this game has all the makings of a must-win matchup. Last week's win against Idaho might be in the books, but it wasn't pretty. The Ducks' offensive line struggled to protect our new quarterback, Dylan Gabriel, who was sacked three times more than Bo Nix faced in almost an entire season. Coach Lanning didn't hold back, stating, we didn't play well enough. With injuries forcing lineup changes, including starting walk-on Charlie Pickard at center, the offensive line needs to step up big time against Boise State. Lanning is clear, they've got to clean up the miscommunications and play to the high standard Oregon is known for. But it's not just about protecting Gabriel. Boise State is bringing a fierce rushing attack, led by running back Ashton Janty who just put up a jaw-dropping 267 yards and six touchdowns last week. Lanning even called him the best running back he's seen since taking over at Oregon. This powerful Boise State offense won't go down easy, and the Ducks' defense will have to be on high alert to keep them in check. On a brighter note, Lanning confirmed that we might see the return of key players like Matthew Bedford and Gary Bryant Jr., both of whom are recovering from injury. Their presence could be a game-changer as the Ducks look to iron out the kinks from last week. This Saturday's matchup is set to be intense, and you won't want to miss a second of the action. If you're as hyped as we are, drop a like on this video and make sure to subscribe to our channel for more in-depth coverage, analysis, and all the latest news on your Oregon Ducks football team. Let's go Ducks!